Just reach at Patong and from here our hostel is around 300 meters. So now we have arrived at our hostel. The name of the hostel is Labdi Phuket. We will be staying here for 3 days and this hostel is very close to Patong beach. And now it's time for check-in process. We have booked 2 beds in 4 bed dorm and it cost us 900 rupees per person per day. This is the room, on the left side there are beds and on the right side they have given us cupboard where we can keep our luggage and there is a hangers as well. And this one is my bed. And here we have balcony as well and it's a really nice thing. Generally you will not get balcony in most of the hostels. In this hostel there are two common washrooms on each and every floor, one for boys and one for girls. As you can see the washroom is very clean and the plus point is that here you will get hair dryers which you will not get in other hostels. And this is the shower section. Now it's 1.30 pm and first we are going to 7 Eleven where we'll buy some water bottle and mints. While coming from India, we carry 3000 baht per person, out of which we have spent 2200 baht on visa, then we have spent 180 baht on minibus and from the remaining amount I will buy some things at 7-Eleven and then I will buy a sim card as well. Here we bought 2 water bottles and 2 packet of mints which cost us 50 baht. After coming out of 7-Eleven, here we bought a sim card. Yeah, yeah. 115 day? Yeah, one SIM card. In SIM card you will get option of 7 days, 15 days and 30 days. Here you can check the prices for SIM card. The number at the top is phone number. After buying SIM card, we stop at currency exchange where we change dollar into baht. So we just exchanged 300 US dollar at a rate of 34 and we got 10,200 baht for 300 dollars. Now we are going for a lunch. My friend Gautam is pure vegetarian so we are going to Indian restaurant to eat Indian food. Later I am going to try Thai food. If you eat non-veg then you can go with street food as the price is quite cheap compared to the restaurant and the quality of street food is also great. Here we order paneer tikka masala and butter naan. The name of restaurant was Tantra and the taste of food was same as the normal Indian restaurant. This is the swimming pool of Labdi Phuket Hostel. After coming from the market in afternoon, we went to swimming pool of the hostel where I done some swimming and I played a volleyball. After that I had a nap because I haven't slept properly. So now it's 9 pm and now I'm going to explore walking street of Phuket. Well, you will see plenty of massage parlor on the streets of Thailand and the massage in Thailand is very cheap compared to India. Now we are going to walking street which is 700 meter from our hostel.
它比较适合吃南京牛肉。不要吃太贵的，我们在哪里吃嘛？这里可以吗？这家行吗？这里可以啊，这家行吗？While going to walking street, we just stop at the fruit shop. Okay, it is also at fifty baht. Okay, give me one pineapple juice. If you are buying three packs, then it will cost you hundred baht. That is thirty three baht per packet. So I just bought this pineapple juice at fifty baht, and it is nice. From here, the area of walking street starts, and I don't think this is the main road. Now we are at Bangla Walking Street which is the famous walking street in Phuket and this street is known for its nightlife Here on this street there are plenty of clubs restaurants pubs and gogo bars Now we are feeling hungry so we are going to Patong beach to try this street food. Now I am trying the famous dish in Thai food which is pad thai. Pad thai is available in both veg and non-veg options so here I order chicken pad thai. My friend Gautam has decided that he will not try this street food. He is not trying street food because veg and non-veg both the foods are prepared on the same pan. For pure vegetarian I don't think street food will be an option.
एंड नाउ इट्स टाइम टू ट्राई चिकन पैट थाई हाउ इज इट इज गुड डू यू थिंक इट इज वर्थ पेइंग 100 बात so basically this is thai food it will not be spicy but it is nice like if you, if you want to try out something then you should definitely try this just completed the dinner if you are trying thai food and you want spicy then just ask him to add some chilies in it this is the main entrance of bangla walking street While exploring Walking Street, Gautam decided that he will try burger at Burger King. Now we came to Burger King, so he had ordered a veg burger meal, and it cost two eighty nine baht. After dinner, we explore the remaining part of the Walking Street. So that's how we are spend our first day in Phuket and now we are going back to hostel Here I am ending the vlog and I will meet you guys in next vlog